Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2, uh, Tropical Fun. Now, uh, we're sitting here at the uh, hub that we got operational with trains flung at it uh, last time around, uh, at least if my uh, memory serves correctly. Uh, so yeah, we've got, uh, we got trains tooling around. Uh, now, uh, obviously at some point I'm going to have to balance all of these lines out uh and i may actually at some point just uh activate the nafis um mod uh so we get universal state cars uh now that's you might think that's cheating but you know we have universal trucks so you know why not state cars but the uh, nafis uh, state cars uh carry a third less than the uh, regular um uh uh, more cargo specific uh, wagons uh, so uh, you know and that uh, and I'm thinking that the nafis might work well for the interhub uh, connections now I'm looking at what to do this time we have this here um, fuel refinery connected up uh, with uh, boats but this here uh, we've got uh, this large island here which has uh, three um, industries on it and what I'm thinking is uh, uh, what I want to do is uh, well connect these three uh, up but okay uh, this is gonna bother me unless I get rid of those now for these two uh, an oil refinery can take the entire output of two oil wells. So I can just feed the output of this straight into here. And then I'm thinking, uh, if I put a couple, if, well, I can put a, uh, hmm, um, yeah, I'll I'll start with that. Uh, okay, so uh, we're gonna need a building, uh, which is gonna be this. We don't need catenary on this. Uh, okay, here, and we're gonna need. Um, hmm. Can I, if I could punch a, a line through here. Uh, no, I won't. Uh, okay, and I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need to get uh, get everything from there onto the mainland somehow. Um, I could bring them in over here. I think that, yeah, because this. Because we've got this town in the way here. So if I bring... Yeah, that's what I'll do. Okay. So I'm going to... Uh, first of all, I'm going to put that in a better orientation. Uh, right. Uh, yeah, we'll face it that way. Um, and then uh, I'm going to need two... Now, I'm going to go with one platform here initially, and I'm going to need uh, two platforms over here. Uh, yeah, okay. So, um, the first, uh, first thing I'm going to do is, uh, that's the Ventura oil well. I'm going to rename this to Ventura Oil Well. Now this is the Ventura Oil Refinery. And I uh, can't operate a keyboard apparently. This will also be the Ventura Oil Refinery. Yep. And this is going to be the Ventura Conmats plant. Right? So this also will be 
construction materials plant. Okay, good. Uh, okay, so now uh, no catenary on this. Uh, this I need to send. Uh, yeah, I need to send uh, uh, wagons over here. Uh, and uh, okay, now what am I going to do here? I'm going to need a couple of uh, tracks coming out of here, uh, which can come around like this. Yeah, okay, I can do that and. I'm going to need a crossover over here. Yep. Now, um, I'm going to need uh, three platforms here that will pick up. What? Hello, what? Have 400 kilometers of tracks. Trans Siberian Railway. Nice. Uh, so, I'm going to want to come, uh, so I want, so I'm going to need three platforms here that are going, well, one platform here, it's going to be a pickup and three tracks. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to want to run the, uh, rail line up the middle here. Okay. In that case, uh, we'll see what, uh, I'll get the uh, tracks uh, laid out here. Okay. Uh, I didn't think that through too well, because this is going to have to be station track here. Yeah, you know, I wish they'd do something about the track being in 11,000 pieces when you lay it parallel to a station. Okay, uh, now here we configure it and we want a pair of through tracks here and a track for the platform and a second platform. Yeah, okay, now we can connect this up. Right. And then this is going to be like so. And then and I'm coming across over there. So this is going to need to bend right away. I think we can get away with that bend. Yep. Yeah, I think we can. And then this is going to need to come on here as well. Uh, double slip that. And then I need to get it up. Hmm. Where do I want to get this connected in over here? Well, based on the way the platforms are set up here, I can get one in here, one in here. Well, I could get, I can get three of them in over here. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Uh, okay, so I'm going to work at it from over here. Uh, configure. Well, we're going to need... Uh, two there. Uh, a platform. And then 
one more track. Yeah. Okay, so that should uh, that should allow for for that to uh, to work. Now, I need to get across. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So what I need to do. Oh, this could be a little bit challenging. Oh, no, not so much. I just need to come out like this. Yeah. And out like this. And then I can do this. Yeah. That'll work. And then I can take this and go up a bit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That might allow it to work. Bridge pillar collision. Uh, with but not with that one. Okay. Uh, so if we do it like this, okay. How? Yeah, it has to be all the way. Okay. And this one up and over yeah and I need to get over that one as well uh, okay so we'll keep it up and actually that's okay so I'll take that and this one yeah okay now, where do I need to go across? Over there. So, I'll uh, let it go back down. And then, yeah, we'll come up to here. Yeah, like that. Good. Now, I need to get across. Now, I don't think I need to get ships under this, but if, uh, if I can at least allow it to get ships under it, that's uh, not a bad thing. Uh, okay, and then we can grab this. Good. Now, we need to get around to here. Oh, that's not so bad. So I think this will work. Uh, okay, so that gets us three platforms over here, three platforms here, and one private line. Now, if I do, hmm, hmm, yeah, okay, so I'll, uh, hmm. Well, if I do this, that should allow me to get uh, to get a train on there. Okay, yeah. Well, now uh, we need to signal this. Okay, so the private line. Okay, and this one here. Uh, no, I'll. Uh, right. I need to, uh, of course, uh, put signals on this too. 
right and there and there yep okay now I need uh, signals along here uh, yeah bunch of signals along here Okay, I think that'll work. Uh, okay, so now I'm going to fling some trains at this. Now, where's the uh, depot? What depot was I using? Um, it's over here, isn't it? Okay, I need to do a little bit more to fling trains at this. Yeah, just a little bit more. Um, right. Uh, okay, now, can I get a track off it? No. Well, um, well, if I do that, That will get me uh, trains on there. Okay. Where's the depot? There it is. Okay. Uh, what do I need over here? Two tankers, a gondola, and a flat car. Okay. Okay, diesel engines. What have we got? Um, this one. Okay, that's fourteen fifty and uh, two hundred. Right, and we. What was I? Oh, I was probably using the Mikado still or something like that. Yeah, let's go with a diesel. Um, yeah, let's grab that one, uh, cargo. And uh, right, uh, we need tank cars. That carries 18. You know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, we can still put ten of them on there. Okay. Um, buy two of them. Uh, clear that out. And we need gondola. Thirteen, eighteen, eighteen. Uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight of them. Yep, that'll do. Uh, bye. And, uh, I need also, uh, flat cars. Um, 18. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine will do. Buy one of those. Okay. Well, I'll uh, just uh, put a pin in that. 
and you you can go here to here yep what am I calling things? Just CR. Okay. So that's uh, CR vent oil well to vent oil refinery. Okay. Then we have another one. Um, new line. And that's going to go from here to here yep so that's going to be uh, vent oil refinery to denton hub right yep and over here that's uh the gondolas uh it's going to go from here to here could not connect all stations really uh, anyway uh, that's going to be vent con mat to denton hub uh, stone okay now why can't it connect all stations oh maybe okay uh definitely need one of these okay now you uh, manage line um no Uh, right. Okay. Now, why isn't that one working? Manage line. Um, Well, we have the, yeah, that looks fine. So is that, so is that, so is that, and so is that. And that. Uh, there we go. Now it's working. Good. Now we'll go in here. New line goes from here to here. And that's going to be Ventura Conmat to Denton Hub. Uh, con mats. Uh, okay. Now, let's go over here and uh, take a look. We've got a tanker coming out there. Let's up the tempo. Uh, okay. So what we're going to do is uh, ride the uh, the um, a flat car one, and uh, you know just uh, you know enjoy the scenery. Um, of course, that requires the uh, trains to launch. Oh, I see, it was blocked, right? And we're up to 1956 for uh, game date, so uh, it won't be long and we'll be able to uh, 
you know, basically just uh, maximize our um, our uh, trains and everything with modern trains and trucks and so on. Um, hopefully that one, when it clears, will uh, do it in time for this, uh, yeah, okay. There's the uh, gondola uh, train. There we go. So that one will go through. And will it go through? Will it get to the signal in time for this one to launch, or do we have to... Yep, yeah, we launched. Okay. So we'll ride this on... Uh, well, let's uh, ride it on fast uh, just to get through the station here. Okay, let's uh, drop back to uh, normal time here. Uh, so this uh, train should be able to uh, get up uh, quite, uh, quite a lot faster than the uh, previous ones. So we get uh, a uh, pretty uh, substantial tour of the uh, through lines here. I think we might get to a hundred before we get to the uh, divergence point. I definitely got to ninety anyway. Well, we're holding around 80, so, you know, that's not too bad. Oh, hello, autosave. Yeah. Okay, I think once we get over this uh, crossing, uh, we're at the uh, divergence point. After this uh, train ride, I'm going to put the cut in and uh, end the part. Uh, I'm not sure quite what the uh, next part's going to be. Uh, probably uh, moving a little further down the, uh, the map and connecting some more stuff together.
Wow, this is uh, quite uh, busy. Okay, we're at the uh, Denton Hub uh, station. Uh, right, we're going to have to wait for, uh, for that train to uh, finish uh, passing before we can uh, exit here. Um, yeah, when it gets past the signal up there. Uh, oh, that's right, we uh, have the traffic from the other trains uh, launched as well. Hey, we've got, uh, we should have clear sailing now. Uh, the other train should be able to make at least the same speed we do, so. You know, this doesn't look half bad, uh, coming over top of that uh, line below. Then we dive into the landscape over here. Ooh, I like the look of that. That looks uh, quite, uh, quite pleasing, really, with the uh, bridge going up in the distance there. You know what? Uh, I had some uh, doubts that this would be uh, would be uh, an okay bridge when I was uh, building it, but uh, yeah, I thought it was going to turn out to be a humpy bridge, but it doesn't look like a big hump. If anything, it looked sway-backed on the way uh, up to it here. Yeah, but uh, it's tolerable, so... Uh, yeah, I think I can live with that. Okay, there's the uh, private uh, oil to uh, crude oil to the refinery train uh, off on the left, and there there's the uh, train taking the uh, refined oil back to the hub. And there's our gondola train heading off to the uh, quarry or the Conmats plant. Overall, I think this is okay.
And there's just enough uh, gap between the trains that we shouldn't have any uh, any problem with uh, queuing here. Okay. Uh, well, that'll do. Uh, good. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to do next. Um, I think I might faff about a bit with the, uh, the, um, passenger line, actually. Because we got the electrified passenger line up into, uh, Sacramento. I think I'll electrify this bit. And, uh... Yeah, uh, yeah. I think I, I think I might do that. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this part. Uh, so uh, I'm going to um, set up over here where we can observe some uh, train-like things happening. Uh, and I think I should probably adjust my graphics settings. Anyway, uh, so that's all for now. Uh, so stay healthy. Uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And uh, see you back next time.